Well, finally, today we learned more about a massive new facility coming to Batavia. It's a new healthy living campus. It's being created by a partnership between the YMCA and Rochester Regional Health's United Memorial Medical Center. They broke ground today on a new $33.5 million, 78,000 square foot campus on Bank Street. It's something that we got to learn a lot more about earlier today. Here's what Robert Walker, the CEO for GLOW YMCA, had to say about what services are going to be offered all under one roof when this campus is complete. Today is a historic day for our community's health and wellness journey. Through the, the, through the collaboration between our many volunteers and staff, this new state-of-the-art facility will integrate healthier living through a holistic approach. We'll both be stronger for it. We are on the path to improve access to services and programs in the city of Batavia and surrounding areas of Genesee County. Plans for the new facility include a new indoor pool, group exercise studios, a wellness center with the latest exercise equipment, indoor walking and running track, a teaching kitchen, and, excuse me, adventure room play area for uh, children. Our partnership with United Memorial Medical Center will provide primary care, behavior health, prevention, outreach, and educational services all in the same facility under one roof, and they'll be integrated. Not that the hospital is a portion and the Y is a portion. It's important that we collaborate everything we do under that roof. And we've talked at length about that. New York Secretary of State Robert Rodriguez was also in Batavia for today's groundbreaking. And he spoke at length about just how important a project like this is for that city, that region, and how it can be a model for other cities across the state and even nationwide. We're sharing a portion of his comments to hear more on that perspective tonight. This is really exciting, and, and what's um, really critical about what we do at the Department of State and really the Downtown Revitalization Initiative is really trying to make sure that we provide that seed capital to be able to really transform what are historic downtowns that may have been uh, ignored over time but just need a little push, just need a little bit of investment to really help it um, you know, uh, take the step needed to make it into the 21st century and, and, and be that destination that we know that downtowns are and continue to be. And with this, this really is what we expect to be a central focal point of the downtown revitalization of Batavia. Now, this is an, in a, an innovation that we began six years ago. So this is the second um, uh, round of our downtown revitalization initiative. And this is where we're at that point years of planning, years of work, years of collaboration, and the $10 million that we grant doesn't get you all the way there, so you have to have a lot of partners in your community, a lot of stakeholders who are investing in the community to really make this work. So here we are today to celebrate 60,000 square feet, YMCA, uh, and a complimentary medical building. And what you planned has and will be a model for other downtowns. I've already visited downtowns that say we want something similar with a, with a, with a medical center and a YMCA uh, or, or, and, and, and something exactly like you will be building first. And that's just an incredible vision and something that didn't happen by itself. And we realized that by creating this center, creating this place of wellness and, 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 and also of economic vitality, we are potentially going to be bringing 3,000 people a day to the center of Batavia. And think about what that will do for the downtown and the surrounding areas. But we most importantly want everyone to be healthy. And I think the pandemic has shown us that being able to provide medical support as well as health and wellness is really the, the future of how we take care of ourselves in our communities. This new healthy living campus is scheduled to open there on Bank Street in Batavia in late 2023.